Uh oh, guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Huh? Anybody? Julie, hey, guess what day it is? Oh, come on, I know you can hear me. Mike, 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 what day is it, Mike? <laughs> Leslie, guess what today is? It's hump day. Woo woo! <laughs> Can't have happier people watching the Carrollton Morning Announcements. I don't know. I'd say happier than a camel on a Wednesday. You watching the Carrollton Morning Announcements. Hey! Good morning! Good morning, Carrollton High School, and welcome to Carrollton Morning Announcements. I'm Chase Fortner. And I'm Connor Monquist, and we are your hosts for today, Wednesday, April 24th, 2024. NHS will meet on Thursday, April 25th, before school in the chorus room, and after school in the Marbury Art Center. Please email one of your sponsors if you can't make it to one of the meetings. Our color guard will be doing formal auditions this week, uh, April 22nd, 23rd, and 25th from 4 to 7 p.m. Please see Ms. Fisher by this Friday if you are a graduating senior and enlisted in one of the military branches. Now over to Jack and Mason for Trojan Sports. Here are today's CHS sports announcements. The boys tennis team lost a close 2-3 match at Camden County Tuesday. Winning at first and second singles were Caleb Taff and Hudson Mosier. The future is very bright for our young team. Trojan Esports had two enormous wins on Tuesday. Splatoon beat Northview 3-0 to advance to the Final Four in-person GHSA Championship. Also, our Smash team beat Thomas County Central to advance to the Final Four. Smash will play again on Thursday and Splatoon will play again on Wednesday at University of West Georgia. CHS volleyball trials will be held May 1st through 3rd in the CHS main gym from 3.45 to 5.45 p.m. Please make sure you have a physical on file with Coach Harper prior to tryouts. There will be a girls wrestling interest meeting in Coach Newton's room at 8 a.m. Thursday morning. Please stop by. The cross country team will host a parent meeting on Thursday, May 2nd at 5.30 in the Hall of Fame room. We will discuss summer training and tryouts for the fall. Please plan on attending if you are interested in joining the team or will be returning. Today in Trojan Sports. Esports, state playoff round three, four o'clock. Varsity girls lacrosse, state playoff round one versus North Cobb, 5.30. And the varsity boys lacrosse, state playoff round one versus North Cobb at 7.30. Coming tomorrow in Trojan Sports, Esports state playoff championship Smash Bros, four o'clock. Varsity girls golf at Meadow Lakes versus Darlington at 3.15. Varsity boys soccer state playoff round two at Archer at seven o'clock. Baseball state playoff round one, doubleheader at home versus Harrison at 4.30. Good luck, Good luck to, to our, our Trojan, Trojan athletes. athletes. Now on to the senior section. Seniors, if you haven't already, please email any scholarship award information to Ms. Fisher by this Friday, April 26, to be included in the graduation program. In addition, complete the senior survey to have your graduation plans included in the graduation program. Check your email for an infinite campus message with the link for the senior survey. Again, the deadline is this Friday, April 26. Any student that is planning to attend the 2024 Georgia Service Academy Day on Saturday, April 27th, hosted by Senator John Ossoff, or would like more information, please see Mrs. Fisher in the guidance office to let her know for any, for get any additional information about the event. Now on to Jack for our CHS weather report. Good morning, Carrollton High School. This is your chief weather reporter, Jack Wendez, for your weather update. Today's weather is calm for a forecast high of 74 and a low of 50. It will be partly cloudy during the day. CHS, guess what day it is? Hot day! Have a great Wednesday, CHS! Now back to our anchors for today in history! Thanks, Thanks Jack. Jack. President John Adams uh, approves today in history. President John Adams approves legislation uh, legislation to appropriate five thousand dollars to purchase uh, necessary books as may be uh, as may be necessary for the use of Congress. Uh, thus, establishing the Library of Congress, the first books ordered from London arrived in 1801, and were stored in the U.S. Capitol, uh, the library's first home. Happy birthday to Andrew Slay. Uh, Cody Reed and Jordan Sheriff and yesterday to Miss Grubbs. The SAT word of the week is eclectic as used on the SAT made up of variety of sources or styles as used in a sentence although the art festival was supposed to be eclectic it mainly consisted of painters trying to sell their work. Remember opportunity starts here to make the most of today's opportunities. That is all for us this morning. Thank you for watching the Kelton Morning Announcements. We hope you have a wonderful Wednesday and go Trojans! Trojans.